You see, and see reporter Glenn Counts tells us what police are doing to step up patrols. Firecrackers, fights, and general mayhem have spoiled the fourth in the past. Last year, police drew a line. This year, they plan to do the same with even more officers. The, the ones that want to come to enjoy themselves should feel safe and secure. The ones that come to try to disrupt that have got to realize that, that they were going to be aggressive with them. The department will put an extra 450 officers on the street this holiday, which is 100 more than last year. They will be joined by 100 sheriff's deputies, all to speed the arrest processing, which got bogged down last year. If you get out in the middle of the street and disrupt traffic, you know, you're going to be arrested. Uh, if you throw fireworks at others, you're going to be arrested. If you start fighting or involved in, in that type of behavior, you're going to be arrested. Obviously, if you bring weapons uh, uh, with you, you're going to be arrested. Those extra officers will come from canceled vacations and days off. The shifting of officers from some investigative units and special details. The traffic unit will be out to search for drunk drivers, and the civil emergency unit will handle unruly crowds. If all this sounds like the police are preparing for war, that's not the case. They believe that if someone is thinking about doing something stupid, once they see all the cops, they will back down. We'll have officers in plain clothes, we'll have officers in undercover, we'll have officers looking at cameras, we'll have officers in our sky watch, uh, we'll have officers, a lot of different things going on to try to detect. Well, one of the things that police say that you can do in order to help them is they are expecting a lot of phone calls from people who are reporting, people who are using firecrackers, which, as you know, are illegal here in Mecklenburg County. Instead of calling 911 to report that, they're asking that you call 311 because they don't want the emergency communications all tied up with those types of phone calls. Reporting live from our WCNC mobile newsroom here in Uptown, I'm Glenn Counts.